I guess I'm doing a little day in the life of isolation in New Zealand. If you saw from my last vlog, the government does a hotel isolation program for any New Zealanders returning home before you get to enter the country. A good way to keep New Zealand COVID free. Okay, so it is day eight. I am going to leave my hotel room for the first time in since I arrived here. I literally have not gone outside. I'm gonna go check out the exercise area and if there's not too many people there and I feel like I can socially distance, then I'll stay and do a little workout. So it is day 10 of my isolation here. I have four days to go and then I am free to be outside in New Zealand. I don't know. I just feel like I've been sleeping my life away in here. The exercise area, it's not really an exercise area that I thought it was gonna be. It's just sort of a little concrete area where you can walk around. When I like to work out, I like to work out alone with these like no one watching me and I kind of just felt like everyone's just sort of walking around in circles. So. I don't really know what I'm gonna do today. I normally just video call my friends. I stream a bit. <laughs> my hotel room is slowly becoming a mess because they don't let cleaners or anyone come inside, obviously, for health precautions. We do our own dishes, we change our own sheets. I know we have one more swab test on Thursday, so that should be on day 12. And then on the 14th, when we find out that we're negative, we get to leave. So we've had two swab tests. We had one on day three, which was negative. So I'm feeling very thankful for that. But I did hear on the news, someone at this hotel in this isolation, someone that was positive, so. There are two new COVID-19 cases. There's one case of managed isolation in Christchurch, a woman in her 30s who came from the Philippines via Hong Kong on the 29th of August. I'm hoping for them that they're doing okay. So it's not long, I'm feeling super excited. I haven't seen my mom since she came and visited me in Manila last year in August. So that's the last time I've seen her. So it's been just over a year since I've seen my mom. So I get to see her soon and spend some quality bonding time together. I'm the negative. Oh my gosh, awesome. Thank you. Yeah, so you're all good. All Thank right. you so, so Thank much. You. No okay. problem. Bye. All right, bye. Okay, so it is officially day 14. <laughs> I have completed my entire isolation program stay. I'm finally free. I'm just packing my bags and about to head to Christchurch Airport to fly to Auckland where I'm gonna finally see my mom. I cannot believe it's been two weeks that I've been here. It's crazy. Ah, it feels weird that I'm finally gonna like be able to be free in the outside world. So on day 12, we had our final swab test and I found out yesterday that it was a negative. So we're all free to go today. Leave and be free. <laughs> I feel like I like live here in this hotel now. I'm not sad to go. I'm excited to leave, that's for sure. But it was a marathon, but we made it.
Mom found a little Filipino store. Hi. Masaya ka ba dito? 